Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to the Big Blue House. Koya, I hope you guys had a fantastic, fantastic weekend. Um, what's next? I gotta do water. Um, let's do scorps. See what my scorps are at. My love, now until the 14th. See my little Scorpios are out. You already saw the Empress. Yep, yep, I did. Alright. Get my Scorpies out. Guess I'll take them. <laughs> Guess I'll take them. Alright. Queen of Cups, King of Swords, Nine of Wands. All up, right? New Soul Twin. Ace of Cups. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Eight of Swords. Reversed. Alright, Four of Wands. Reversed. The Queen of Pants. So you're sitting pretty. Okay? My love. Queen of Cups, King of Swords, Nine of Wands, Soul Twin, the best reversed, Ace of Cup upright, Eight of Swords reversed, Four of Wands reversed, Queen of Pens upright. So, and to me, right off the bat, it's like you're loving, you're loving yourself, you're loving the new energy, um, you're loving someone. This King of Swords, his, his sword is down. Um, you're looking away. You're looking away from him. So I'm not really sure what that means. We do have the Nine of Wands. So it's like I feel like you're definitely defense mode. Like you don't want to let nobody in right now, which clearly would be a twin. All right. Um, you got a lot of love. Could be a lot of love for yourself. All right. You are coming out of feeling like the eight of swords when it comes to your twin when it comes to this king of swords you're coming out of feeling like you're trapped like you don't have to have your twin to be independent and clearly you know that you figured that out because you're the queen of pens upright okay so this is beautiful that i know a lot maybe cross watch certain people don't want to hear it but it's like i think it's beautiful that you regained composure you you did whatever was necessary to move away and it's not a bad thing okay because it can come back around and when it's time it's time it just means you let things you let and things just happen naturally okay and some of you just were like i'm done okay so that's okay too so to me i feel like you're loving life i'm not shitting you I mean, you start off with the Queen of Cups and you end with the Queen of Pence. So it's like you're right in your flipping element, all right? That's for sure. The only thing you're just, like, not sure of is the whole twin thing. And everything else is upright. Right, going on with my scores. Tell me about this Queen of Cups. Guys, like, I want back out. I put them back. I put them back in. All right. Okay. All right. So, listen, with this Queen of Cups, all right, you put an off out there. Something didn't go right, all right? It's a three of swords. You were heartbroken, all right? Um, you walked away. All right. This is my walk away card too. You definitely walked away. There's somebody in the background walking away. Or well, somebody walked away from you. All right. Maybe that's why your back's turned. I don't know. Um, you got the nine of swords. So it's like.
I like that. Yeah, yeah, nines because that's brand new stuff. But like, you were sad. Okay. Um. Probably had anxiety. Tough time sleeping. You know, nine of swords. Um, but then you're looking at all this, because this is the fool. All right, you're looking at the broken hat. This sounds awfully familiar, like a, someone I just did with the broken hat and all that and, and taking the risk. You know, like, do I want to take the risk because this person broke my hat? This is the same with something, one an element I did, all right? But you got the fool, all right? A very spiritual guided thing, all right? And you're looking at it, and you're like, do I want to take this risk again? Because this person's coming in with a message. It's King of Swords coming in with a message, and you're literally like, I started new. So, tell me about the King of Swords. So the person who obviously this king of swords, all right, is the person who has broken your heart. You are before and you kind of like, do I want to take this risk all over? So obviously this king of swords is coming in and offering, um, offering love. Okay. Um, yeah. King of wands. That's how it was with the other one too. Which freaking zodiac was that? Because they were coming in as the king of wands too, but it was the swords energy. No, they were coming in with this energy, but it was the swords. It doesn't matter. Um, it's obviously your twin, right? Coming back around, coming back into the picture, and now you're just like, do I want this new stat? Do I not want this new stat? Um, tell me about this. What does this King of Wands want? Princess of Swords, all right? It's just coming in with a message. It's going to tell you how it is, why things went down the way they went down, okay? Wow. This is mirroring, mimicking a different zodiac. It's either Cap, it's either Taurus or Pisces. Anywho, that you're gonna come in. This person's gonna give you a message, and you, you're gonna find yourself in the situation where the opportunity is being presented to you again. Tell me about the Nine of Wands. The hermit. So it's like you're soul searching right now. So I don't know what you're gonna do because you you your twin is not part of this right now, in your eyes. Um, you're also coming out of hermit mode because you recognize something too. Um, the magician. Holy shit! Everyone's coming out like this. It's freaking beautiful, and it's the same zodiacs I just mentioned. Holy shit! The scorpion energy. Um, you're more than capable of handling the scenario when this person comes in with this message, okay? You are. You're more than capable of handling it. Tell me about Soul Twin. Queen of Cups, which is you. With the Wheel of Fortune, it's the same freaking kind. It's destined event with the Six of Cups. This is destined. And you're just like, I don't know. I'm not going to lie to you. That's where you're at. You're in I don't know scenario. Um, It's so crazy that the, the Wheel and the Six of Cups, all right? Because it's like this woman's dressed out of... All these cards are all different, but I will tell you, when my Six of Cups, this is somebody you definitely have a past life with. I mean, this is a different century. This is the only card that speaks different century. Well, not the only one, but I mean, clearly, look at it. Okay? And it, it's, it's right on top of the Wheel of Fortune of, of a Destiny event, right on top of your Soul Twin. Okay? So, like, this is Destiny. It doesn't mean you have to take it, obviously. Okay? But maybe they were just here to, to teach you a lesson, and that's it. Okay? Everyone's in a different scenario. There is love, okay? Um, this person is coming to offer the Queen of Cups. This, they're coming to, I don't know what they're offering, but it looks like they're offering love. But I will tell you, they are coming in with a message, and it is going to be sword energy. Well, they're coming in as fire, but with the, what I mean by the sword energy is that this person is now going with the flow. This card is very flowy. 
and you're gonna get the truth though. And but there's a butterfly on her thing too. So this person has changed. All right, they are coming as in as the king. Okay, but this card is very very flowy. This person does want to just go with the flow. That's what I'm reading. I understand that this person had you feeling like this, but you got yourself out of it, and it's beautiful. You are now the queen of pence, so you're definitely grounded. Um, tell me about the ace of cups. This person's going to come in and offer this cup, and I think you've offered it plenty of times, and it didn't happen, and that's why you found yourself in this scenario. Yeah, the king of swords, he's going to come in and offer, okay? It's the knight of swords, sorry. This person's coming in and swinging, too. There's nothing stopping this person right now. This person's going to fight for this connection. Um, and, and the bottom line, as of right now, you're still wondering if you're going to do this or not because, because of the scenario. But I will tell you, there's been growth. I, I mean, the coming in as the king and the knight's offer in the cup, but I don't know what you're going to do. This, this king's coming in hot. Um, this knight. All right, with the other knight. I'm like, he's coming in hot. Yeah, he is. So it's like, you're dealing with air, but they're, they're coming in. They're coming in as fire, okay? They might have fire in the chat, but they're coming in as fire, but they're projecting the air element, all right? Um, I think you're dealing with air, and they're coming in as fire. But they may have fire in the chat, too. Don't get me wrong. All right, they could have water in their chat, too, and earth. Um, but this person is, is coming and swinging, and they're fighting. They're fighting for you. They're ready to take action. And tell me about this Eight of Swords. Um, that's a lot, but I'm, I feel like I'm kind of feeling it. We got the Queen of Wands, okay, with the Princess of Pen saying, look, I've offered this already. Like, you're like Queen B, the Queen of Swords. You're like, meh, I don't know, all right? But the Knight of Cups is looking at you like, but hey, I got this cup for you. I don't know what you're going to do, guys, but that, that's how that is right now. That's literally how I'm reading that. Like, you caused me to be in my Eight of Swords. In all reality, you probably caused yourself to be in your Eight of Swords. You you did because Eight of Swords is mental, guys. So could their thoughts, their words, their actions put you in that Eight of Swords? Yes, but you sat in that Eight of Swords because it's your mental mentality. It's it's where you are at, okay? So you got two counter suits on the board. Um, I'm not surprised, though. All right, you've offered this already, and they didn't take it. So now you're just like... Your, your sword's in the air, which is so funny because I keep saying that. So I'm not sure I'm reading it right because you're so content. And this just happened with, um, just look down, there's a bug right there. This just happened with, um, Cappies. So I just kind of feel like you're just, you're more, you're thinking more logically than anything. You know, you're just, you're not pouring your emotions out anymore. All right. You're very grounded right now is how I'm reading it. Um, tell me about the four of wands. Why is it reversed? I think just cause you're just not having it to be honest with you. Um, at one point I think you were feeling lonely and... You're not so much anymore. Tell me about the four of wands. Why is my four of wands reversed? Strength. All right. Because you, you pulled yourself you pulled yourself out of that with the four of swords. Yeah, hell yeah, you did. All right. You're, you're resting right now. This, wow, this is identical to another reading. If you guys know, just comment, please, so people don't have to try to go back and find it. Um, but... You you had the inner strength to, to, to push through this because you're like, frig that, mind over matter, done. You're healing. You're in the process of healing. You move forward, and you're, you're pretty grounded, all right? Um, you're definitely grounded. Not pretty grounded. You are most definitely grounded. Tell me about this Queen of Pence. This Queen of Pence is you, ladies and gents, okay? Um, tell 
two of cups. All right. So here comes, you know, that's what I said, why I said you were so grounded. Look at the yin and the yang. Like you managed to ground yourself, but it looks like it's a mutual. Okay. And here's your king of pens, three countersuits. All right. Um, so the king and the queen. All right. This is, this is de divine. All right. But you do got the five of swords. So it's like, was there somebody else in the picture? Maybe at some point, but I'm not going to read into that. All right. This to me is just, you know, mental conflict that you guys have conflicted on yourselves throughout the time. Okay. Um, you got the nine of the pence because right now you're single. All right. You're happy with your 10 of cups, the three of cups, you're partying, you're dating and not even partying excessively. You're just, you're hanging out with friends. You're, you're single, you're content. All right. You are the knight of pence right now. You're, you're looking towards your future and with the star. All right. The death, you accepted your transition. All right. You accepted that you got left out in the cold and that that's it. All right. That's it. Clear as day. That's your scenario right now. So this person is coming back into the picture. All right. And it looks like they're going to offer an apology or vice versa. All right. I feel like you're dealing with air and they're coming in as fire. Um, or they absolutely have fire in the chat too. I feel like they got some water up in, up in the chat too, because they got some water up in here, obviously, because you're water, but the two of you can be grounded and stable. I mean, you're the king and the queen with the two of cups. This is just like silliness. <laughs> like, this is your soul. This is your twin. All right. But there is a little bit of conflict. All right. So, wow. This is mirroring another reading. I know you guys are going to know it. So just put in the comments for the other ladies and gents that, so they know. Okay. So you're just, you've offered before and it just, it was rejected and that's what put you in that state. And that's what also got you out of that state. This queen of swords energy also got you out of that state because you knew you had to think more logically and, and set your emotions aside. All right. You're healing. It's beautiful. Any advice for my, uh, scorps? That's too many. Any advice for my scorps right now, please? Hope. Holy shit. I think they had the same card. Three of my zodiacs have had hope today. Jeez Louise. And it's a nine. It's actually a ten, so it's a brand new beginning. Have hope for this brand new beginning to take place, okay? Damn. Holy crap. When the moon is hidden in the darkest force, it's hard to see your next step. It is easy to see, give in to fear that there will never be safety or light again. I'm here to guide you when you feel lost or on your way. When you feel lost on your way. Whispering to maintain the faith that all good things will come once more. Take one step towards your dream. I will take two steps to help you achieve it. Have hope and only good will come to you. So you don't know what you're going to do. The universe is saying, have a, have a little hope. All right. Um, it is a very destined faded event so have hope okay um this person's coming in this person's gonna fight for you don't don't take advantage of that ladies and gents all right just i know you're probably saying oh well they should and blah 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 i also think there's been a lot of growth and there's there's something that you're unaware of too i can feel it all right um that's that's that simple all right Let's pull some additional messages for you. But I mean, it also looks like you could possibly have a new opportunity with somebody new too, all right? Um, I just wasn't reading it like that because I wasn't. But there is, there is definitely ample opportunity for you to meet somebody else too. I should have called it when I saw it like that, but... Ultimately, you're still going to have to make the decision when this person comes in to talk to you or vice versa, okay? So, there's that. Inner voice. Listen to your inner voice when it comes to this, okay? When it comes to... I love how it's got the two dolphins right there, too. And it is a two. Well, it's an 11, but it comes down to a two. Um, go within to make this decision, all right? Damn. 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 
Damn, 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 damn. So powerful, guys. It's like you guys are freaking magnets. All right, like go within. All right. This this three is celebration. It is you know it is reunions. It is getting back together. It is coming into union and celebrating. Okay. Um, if you're questioning whether or not you had a past life with this person, don't, <laughs> don't. Okay. You definitely had a past life with that, but I've already confirmed that with the Six of Cups. That Six of Cups is past life for sure. All day, a different century. So it's kind of like you guys are at the same stage again. Can you make it work? You know, can you move into that home? Can you have a family life? Can you take that adventure? Will you? What decision will you make? Okay? Because I think this person is, for a very long time, the ball was in the court, and now it's like, the ball's going to be in both your courts. I don't think too many people are aware. I think a lot of people think they have the upper hand here. And I'm telling you, I can clearly see on my board. I can feel the calmness. I can feel the gra I can feel the, the how grounded some of my zodiacs are right now. And ultimately, I, I don't think anyone has the upper hand here when it comes to dealing with a twin. I don't. I think it's I think it's very equal, and I think the decision needs to be made together. Okay, so I think for a long time you waited for this twin to come in and um, whatever the case may be, conversation, the truth, whatever, it didn't matter because you found yourself. But the thing is, I, I don't know if the other, the other one, whoever it is, thinks they have the upper hand because they were the ones that needed to come back around. But in all reality, it's not like that. Nobody has the upper hand here. Nope. It's the tool you went through a lot of crap. That's it. Okay. Um, any other additional messages? Understanding. Someone sitting with guilt too big time. But that would make sense with the five of swords. Okay. Um, somebody sitting with guilt. Okay. Probably the twin. Damn, it was just like the other reading too. They were sitting in guilt too. But the universe, I almost said something about understanding, and I don't know if I said it, but I felt like they were calling for compassion and understanding, and that's why I stressed to you. That's why I said to you, I don't know what you're going to do. What did I say? When this person comes in. Oh, I said there's other factors, all right? So the universe is really asking you to, you know, if you can understand each other and, and just... You're going to fly right through those bars, all right? It's, it's gorgeous. You just have to talk. The tool you have to talk in order for understanding to even occur, okay? I don't know how long it's going to take for this person to... Here we go. We got guilt, though, with the number eight, two of past lives. I'm telling you, like, this is not the only life you shared. And a lot of people got a lot of love for a lot of things. And it's like... Where does this love come from when it comes to my twin and blah, 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 blah. Well, a lot of it has to do with past lives and connections and dreams and all this stuff that's happening. And it's the, the magnetic pole because it's the other half of your soul. So it's kind of like there could have been fear from that century, that lifetime. There could have been. It's something. Okay. Because it's like you got a question sometimes. I can't believe there's this much love. And it's just like it can also come that love. You can be feeling from a different lifetime, okay? Because um, your soul is reconnected. So it's kind of like some people are going to have different feelings, different thoughts, different factors, okay? One more. One more for my sports. Um, if you're not sitting with this guilt, this other person is, and I, I can't even freaking imagine it's you. I didn't see that at all. All right? New version. A new version of you, all right? A new... Understand. And the two of you can have a new version of each other. This is like... The rise of the phoenix too even this is gorgeous this is having each other's back this is looking towards this is so divine i don't know this symbol you're gonna get a letter you're gonna get a message but to me that's the pyramid too the eye but like shaped as like a letter but then you got the moon above it it's just freaking gorgeous and then she got these big ass wings and it's like she's got the phoenix on her legs, like the phoenix feathers all over her legs, and she's like rising, but her twin is literally helping her rise to be this new person. So I feel like 
you guys are literally helping each other heal and, and raise each other. And the two of you inspire each other. And I don't even think you realize that yet. Okay. Um, I'm going to bring this cat in closer. So look at underneath her, the twin is like rising, but look at her legs. It's like, it's got like the Phoenix feathers. Like you see the letter, you see the pyramid, but underneath it actually looks like an envelope. Okay. So it's, it's many, many, many meanings. Okay. So you guys, you guys can rise from this. I'm going to put it that way. It, it, it's freaking gorgeous. I wish you the best of luck when this comes in. I, I truly do. I understand a lot of you are sitting pretty right now and, and very comfortable and very proud of yourselves. But I will tell you in this type of scenario, when something's destined and it comes back around and you know it, don't, don't play. Don't play with each other's emotions. Get emotions. Get straight to the point and figure it out what it is that you guys want. Because it's not time for games anymore. Not when something boils down to something like this. Okay? I love you guys. Have a fantastic rest of your week. Bye, guys.